Look at all these. Insane. Oh, and so check this out, guys. Hold on, let me know. How do I do that? I don't know. Check this out, you guys. So I got evicted from my house today. Not evicted. The landlord supposedly needs the property for something else, so he wants back. But the point is, is uh, out of nowhere, I have this awesome garden, this beautiful garden, and out of nowhere, now my landlord wants this place back. And oh my gosh, like, so I won't be able to plant in another house. I've got these neurological problems. I need this organic, GMO-free food, and I had this beautiful garden all planted and mapped out, and now I'm not even gonna be there for it, and not gonna have time to plant at another place, and it's so expensive to pay for all this this stuff, and I don't know how I'm gonna do it, just, I, I was looking to, to the Lord for answers and help, and I know I'll get it. I've always been blessed, and life's always been good. I just want to show you guys a little bit more of this weather though. This is insane cloud cover. Just because of the fact that it was supposed to be clear skies and blue. And if you look closely where the clouds are kind of lit up. Hold on, let me start giving you. Where the clouds are kind of lit up. If you look closely, that's where you can see like the actual sky, the untainted sky like peeking through, you know? You can see that there's like blue sky back there and then there's all this stuff in front of it they have no regard for our health you know that really tells you the times we live in because obviously if people are going to be getting sick and people are going to be finding all this out then they just don't care and so that must mean that they got the power and control that they do and that they're probably gonna go ahead at some point and pull the plug or flip the switch on all of us anyway but I like Pizza T's positive uh, outlook on it and he said he said that he thinks the government might be trying to protect us and keep the world from ending as long as possible um, and then Oh, you know, um, hope that we have a savior. Hope that like oh, that there's a, a Jesus comes or aliens come or somebody comes to to rescue us from what's ha happening. So I don't know. I hope you're right, Pizza T, and that's a very optimistic uh, point of view. But they do seem to have this attitude that like, oh, it's all like it doesn't matter if it all collapses it doesn't matter if everybody gets sick it doesn't matter if we get caught it doesn't matter if it all comes crumbling down because that's the question what's there because the reason it doesn't matter because we're about to kill them all anyway we're about to round them up and put them in camps uh, at any moment we can flip a switch or push a button and make them sick or make them more obedient or make them more docile or you know, or, you know, do they have these, these, this technology? Look at this cloud. Hold on. I suck, because I've got this neurological, hold the phone still, guys. I'm trying, but look at that. Isn't this funny? I wish you guys could see it, like, real time, what I'm seeing. Hold on, I'm just trying to zoom in and, like I said, because of my neurological problems. Hold on. Dang, I'm sorry, guys. Anyway, it's better zoomed out, I think. Go ahead and zoom out. There we go. Anyways, that's my rant for now. Uh, you know, please share this video with other people. People, they need to start waking up and, and, and caring about things, caring about all this. Like, 
I love my life. I love this earth. I'm not ready for it to end. Like, questions need to be answered. So, uh, this is MC Crawdaddy Pizza Supreme from Z Camp TV signing off for now.